Und bis dann, ciao, ciao. Tschö. Puh, that was weird. It's Monday. The, the full-on virus crisis. That's like a good run, virus crisis. It's going on. It's full effect. All borders are closed. You can't leave Germany at the moment, except for like very important reasons. And no one can enter it. This is the first time in my life that we're living in a separated Europe just in the country and the lockdown is so close like everything is closing schools bars cinemas everything the only thing you're allowed to do is stay at home and go outside for shopping medicine bank and work and also these things especially work uh, won't be happening probably in a couple of days but today i'm legally still allowed to leave leave the apartment I just had the first Skype call with the team to just give them their task and I will now um, head outside without getting close to anyone, at least five meters around me, to get to the car, which is just parked on the other side, drive over to the studio and once I'm there I'm fine because like there is no one, it's just, it's just empty, always. Usually I'd be thrilled that the weather is so nice, but in the current situation it's probably not such a good thing because a lot of people have to stay at home today because most companies do home office. A lot of parents have to stay at home because the schools are all closed. And instead of staying at home on my way here to the studio, they were all outside and in like beer gardens, drinking, having fun, children's on the playground. I don't know if I'm exaggerating or everyone else is just not taking it serious, but the more people don't follow to isolate themselves, the more it will spread, the more it spreads, the harder and the more likely the lockdown is. And I don't want the lockdown. It could be still avoided to 50%. This could work for a couple of months for everyone, but everyone just not doing anything sucks, sucks. So this is basically my first day of self-isolation and I'm trying to make the most positive out of it. I'm trying to imagine myself like it's it's like life usually but with a challenge to it like if you're playing a game and it gets too easy and you challenge yourself by restricting yourself so everything has to continue just without human contact no one is here in the studio just me <sighs> i mean i usually don't mind being alone i like it so i can do more stuff but knowing that this might last for a while it's kind of a little sad I like having my team around me, but I have Skype open every single second and we're just communicating in a chat, like sending tracks back and forth. Um, if anyone has a question, they ask me. We have another list with all of the tasks organized. In the morning, we, we have a call, everyone together to like judge and see what we can do. Maybe a second one later today, if necessary. And it works. We might be even more productive. I mean, maybe the situation <laughs> will make us realize that a lot more is possible online that we usually do in our lives, especially for businesses that are very traditional. Maybe this will solve a lot of uh, traffic problems, People can work from wherever in the world. I'm trying to, to see the positive things. But yeah, Skype is on the entire time. The rest of the day is just making music. I'm, I'm working on the Do To You song, which is very, very close to being finished. I, I don't even know what to change or improve about it. It's the one with the trumpet you heard in the intro. And yeah, so I'm, I'm thinking about maybe starting a new song or take more care of business stuff. I also have scheduled in a couple of hours a Skype call with someone doing an online course. As you know, we, we used to have courses here in person 
for DJing and producing and my team took care of them 100%. But now I also take care of some people and we're trying to schedule as, as many as people are interested in. So if you're interested, very low price, Skype, whatever you need, I'll link it down below in the description. That's that's how we're switching our business. And I think that's the most important switch as much as you can to make it workable without human contact, if you can. I think that's the key to surviving this crisis as, as a business. So yeah, that's basically it. Back to, back to music making. You got me high. Uns dann ja. am Mittwoch wieder. Ciao, ciao. Ja. Ciao. ciao. It's just weird. This entire situation, it's just weird. We're doing our best. It's also what you should do. Stay strong. Don't give up. And now comes the, the, the saddest part. This will be the saddest part every single day because now it's time to leave the studio. And I don't know if I will be able to come back tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. I just don't know. I'm expecting the full lockdown any day and if you're living in Europe you should do the same be prepared for it it's just it's just a fact that it's going to happen I mean look at Italy Spain France is this close to it Germany as well so um, yeah get your things prepared <sighs> that moment <laughs> I hate it I hate it and I will have it every single day but I still appreciate being able to, to actually get here. I also like, I put my bike into the car just to have it at home if I need to get anywhere and, and the roads might be blocked. I don't know what's going to happen. So just in case. And this pretty much also concludes day one of self-isolation. Didn't get close to any other human by at least 30, 40 meters. And yeah, now just driving back home and checking out what Vanessa's actually doing. That was her first home office day. Amazing. I can't imagine. I'm still working. I will be working all night. Uh, one big round of applause for Vanessa. She's working 24 seven, basically. You want some dinner? Just want to cry. Really? That bad? Good food will help you a lot. Yeah. Then maybe some Netflix. I'm working. <laughs> okay, no Netflix. Is it like 10 times more than usually? Hmm, like 50 times or even 100 okay. times. Erhöhen der Distanz ist, des Abstandes ist, also. So yeah, uh, new, new laws by our chancellor um all stores closed except for food and and health and that kind of stuff so we're just one step just one more step away from the lockdown and you know what i'm i'm actually for it i actually think it's necessary put everyone on lockdown for two weeks just make it drastic but this way faster to get over with it but like doing it very slow, I think will cause more problems. So um, yeah, that's my first day on social distancing and isolating. Didn't have any contact with anyone, just Vanessa. That's now reality. So tomorrow, second day of isolation. Like, I mean, it's not funny, but like, I can't believe that I'm saying these things. It just doesn't feel real, but we'll get used to it and we'll learn from it and hopefully learn from it and, and make the best of it. So stay strong, do your best. And hopefully in a couple of weeks or months, this will be all over. Thanks a lot for watching. See you tomorrow again for another vlog. Sign. Things